Hello, hello, this is Wolfstar Games, and welcome back to more Robotics Notes Elite. Last time we had a little bit of downtime with uh, Nye, so we got to have a little bit of one-on-one -on -one time with uh, her and Kaito, and uh, they got to talking, played a little bit of uh, Kill Ballad, and you know, it was all very nice <laughs> and you know and that perfectly sums up who a knight is you know she's a very nice person and i i want to say kaito as well it's like he's he's definitely showing more of his you know personality and who he is and you know, that's not to say that he hasn't so far this game, but, you know, I feel like he's, through progressing through this story, I, I feel that he has changed a little bit, you know. I mean, like I said before, I, I was, when I first started the game, that he was coming across as more of a one note kind of character it's like all about playing video games playing kill ballad and uh, he's really come around in my eyes so and I'm happy that that's the case <laughs> it's like just to have a bland one note character one note character to be the uh, protagonist of this story the main protagonist, anyway. He... He has really changed my viewpoint about him now. Especially with him being more interested in the Kimijima reports and what's going on around him with all this mysteriousness. <laughs> uh, but... Anyway, uh, last we actually left off, Kaito went back home. And, you know, let's uh, see what he's thinking about now. After eating supper, I lie down in the center of my bedroom. There's a lot I need to think about. That's for sure, yes. <laughs> the monopoles. The fact that I got forced into being Model 2's operator. <laughs> Except you volunteered to be Model 1s and, you know, just by process of elimination, Kaito's just the best person to operate a life-size model. <laughs> the fact that the Kill Ballad cheaters have been dead for half a year... Yeah, what a revelation that was, jeez. The final episode of Gunvarel, which is a doozy. <laughs> what I want to do after high school, well, that's a little more normal <laughs> after everything that he's just mentioned. <laughs> it's like, I, I wonder what he does want to do after high school. College? I take it? I mean, it... Most high schoolers do college. Some don't. But... Today, I have only one thing on my mind. Ooh. This music. It's like, funky. <laughs> I really like this. <laughs> uh, my foot's a tapping. <laughs> I've been thinking about it since dinner and even when I was in the bath. Ooh, that little change in the music there. Ooh, I think this is my new favorite track. I've been replaying a simulation of my battle against Nisan in my head over and over again. 
Oh. It's like thinking of, about how good she is and how it, even though that when we did battle her it was such a short string of combos that I had to input but at the, at the same time it's like you know Kaito said that she was like really good so actually gave him a challenge so, which surprises me honestly I mean I wouldn't have pegged Nai to be a really good uh, fighting game uh, gamer. How would Nisong go on the offensive? How should I approach her? Based on the limited information I gathered from our two matches from earlier, I try to imagine her habits. I, I hear like a a little bit of a choir in this track. I mean, it's like ever so softly, but I can I can hear vocals. It's kind of like operatic. <laughs> Even this very moment. When I close my eyes, I can recreate Nisan's Bolt Valiant moves. So... Okay, does Kaito have some kind of, like... I don't think I would call it a photographic memory, but m maybe more like an eidetic memory? If I'm thinking about that right? I'll have to check later. I ridiculously underestimated her. <laughs> as good as I think I am, I've, st I've still got a ways to go. <laughs> After all, I'm second in the world. The next time we play, I'll have to show, I have to show her what I'm made of. <laughs> So he won't hold back next time. <laughs> you get the idea. Oh yeah, loud and clear, Kaito. I've basically only been thinking about Nisan all day. I... <laughs> and not in the way that a nor uh, that most teenagers his age, most teenage boys his age would think about a girl. <laughs> it's almost like I've fallen in love with her or something. Oh. <laughs> um. Well. That. But. He has it, right? I mean, I. I, I still say that. There's. Uh, uh, more of a relationship with him and Akiho than anything. That there's more there to meet than meets the eye. But, you know, I could be wrong, though. I mean, maybe maybe he is falling for an eye. <laughs> I chuckle at the thought. <laughs> hmm. Well, that that was rather interesting there. I've finally come to terms with it today. I'm a weirdo. <laughs> I mean, everyone's a weirdo in their own right. So it's it's all good. <laughs> it's like I'm a weirdo. Kaito's a weirdo. Well, I'm sure. You guys watching are a weirdo in some way. I mean, we're all weirdos. What's wrong with that? <laughs> it's only been a day since we did battle. Plus, she's an adult. 
She's not a student with nothing to do during summer break. This is true. I've been told that my personality changes when it comes to KB, but I finally understand what that means. <laughs> okay, so... Uh, what have you come to understand about your personality when it comes to Kill Bell, then? <laughs> After stopping by Uchigalka Park, I made my way here at 9 in the morning. I've literally been waiting here for nine hours. Just nine hours. Waiting for nine for nine hours? I must look like a total weirdo to passersby. I mean, maybe. <laughs> or maybe they, they think that this is normal. I don't know. <laughs> As far as I'm concerned, however, I'm totally normal. There's only one reason I'm here. To battle with Nisan. And he's willing to wait for nine... upwards to nine hours. I wanted to do battle with her ASAP, so I've been waiting here. I mean... He could have just gone in, find out when she has a lunch break, and then over her lunch break, battle her. If I play KB while I wait, time flies by. It's like, how long is your phone, phone droid's battery life? Kaito, <laughs> it's like that's that's a long time for a, someone to be on their phone. Oh, wouldn't his phone almost be out of juice? <laughs> Online battles make for the perfect warm-up exercise. I massage my tired eyes from over my eyelids with my finger. During lunch, Nisan showed up and treated me to a rice ball. Oh! But he didn't, uh, you know, ask her if she wanted to battle him during her lunch break? <laughs> I managed to get in a battle during that short window. Okay, there we go. She seemed stunned when I told her I'd be waiting until she was finished with work. I mean... <laughs> it's like... She's... at work. And... just... some kid... some... random kid here... just wants to... battle her and kill Ballad... after she's done with work. <laughs> I mean, sure, Kaito isn't exactly a random kid, Nai knows him, but all the same... All the same? Same. <laughs> uh, it, it would seem a little odd to most people that someone would wait to uh, do something like this with someone after they're done with work. I glance at the clock. It's past six. Most people usually get off... Don't most people usually get off of work at five? If they start early in the morning? I mean, like... I mean, like, I've mentioned that I have a full-time job. I start work at 7 a.m. And I'm off by 3.30. So, it depends on what time you start work, <laughs> you know? I mean, if Nai gets... start, If Nai starts at work at 7, 
she would be off by now. But that is not the case. She obviously starts at, like, 9. Or maybe... Or maybe 8, 8.30? If he's thinking about this. Being at... Getting off at 5. So... But... Yeah, she most likely gets off at 6. Maybe she's avoiding me. Uh, I don't I don't necessarily think that Nai would avoid him. I mean, I've literally only showed her how weird I am. <laughs> I probably should have gone home for a bit like she recommended. Okay. She actually said that to him. It's like, it's like, go home. Come back when I get off. There had to have been a better way to go to go about this. For a second there, I thought I read that wrong. But when I get excited, I begin to take drastic measures. Yeah. <laughs> so it seems... Hell, I've lost friends because of this. Oh. Well, there's you. Uh... Hmm. Then maybe you should try and change your habit. Then. Because that's not that's not a particularly good habit to have. Especially if he loses friends like this. Akio's the only person willing to hang out with me now. I mean... I guess it's... only natural, seeing that they're childhood friends. And Akio's a weirdo too! Which is why we're the dynamic weirdos, and everyone makes fun of our club. <laughs> It's like, dun da dun, dun we're the dynamic weirdos! <laughs> the world is a cold, harsh place. From a certain point of view, sure. All I want to do is battle with strong opponents. Hi, Toku. Uh, hi! <laughs> It's like, so she is still here. She's not avoiding him. <laughs> to surprise him. <laughs> and just like that, Nisan is behind me. Oh, it... Well... If she started out behind him, shouldn't she have been off screen? When she said that, Ninja no Matsue that Tarishimaska? No, no, no. no. <laughs> That's extremely far off. Hi. Yeah. Kehai o Keshte Chikazukun wa umai na to. Actually, when she first visited the robot club, she was standing there without anyone noticing. そうですかね。私は普通に近づいてきてるだけですけど。ただ途中で声をかけずに近づいてから声をかけるようにするのが癖でして。ああ。え、right。いや、だだ。I oh. uh, right. yeah, I wonder. Nisan chuckles and points at the bench. Oh, you want to sit on the bench? Not at all. Go ahead. The bench is square shaped and accommodates up to eight people. I could even lie down here. Nisan sits down after I give her a nod. 
a gentle scent wafts by. I, I really like it when we have CGs of Kaito because we never we never do get to see him in a uh, you know a bright model. So it this is the only way we get to see him. It's like they're awfully sitting awfully close. <laughs> I didn't notice it when she dropped by in the afternoon. I always associate Nisan with the smell of sweat. <laughs> That's because she's always moving. Probably because I usually only see her after she's been riding her bike. Yeah. That's why even when she's wearing her Jaxi uniform, my image of her as a sporty type remains as strong as ever. But right now she's wearing a light coat of perfume. I wonder why. I mean, she's a girl. Girls sometimes wear perfume. <laughs> Because she's hanging with me? Or maybe there was an important meeting she needed to attend before meeting up. If she put perfume on because of me, does that mean she's kind of into me? A triple question mark? <laughs> uh, well, i uh, not sure about that, but it, uh, the possibility exists. I mean, there... She's not too much older than Kaito. I don't mind that at all. Nisan is beautiful. Yes, she is. And I don't dislike strong people. In fact, I admire them. Ah, uh, I mean, strong at games, not physically strong. <laughs> of course. <laughs> No, no, you're fine, Nai. She's not gonna say that. Oh, she's gonna say that. That's not surprising. But, Extremely straightforward. <laughs> I mean, that, that's just to say that he's very straightforward is kind of an understatement. <laughs> what I'm looking at, huh? A samurai? <laughs> it's like, uh, really? He sounds like a samurai? <laughs> Did she just totally ignore my feeble attempt at a pickup line? <laughs> that was supposed to be a pickup line? <laughs> wow. <laughs> I mean, uh, not a bad attempt, I guess. <laughs> Well, whatever. <laughs> as long as we can fight. Just... Not just... Uh, not, not physically, though, of course. <laughs> I've heard that before. Nae-san I mean, they, they could go grab dinner together if they really wanted to. Make it a date. <laughs> Nisan probably came by bike. It'd be faster to take my scooter. Uh, yes, it would. 
I should be able to get to the nearest convenience store and back in about 15 minutes. Or how, how, or how about going to like a restaurant or maybe even a fast food restaurant and you know, do a sit down, have dinner. If I were a jerk, I could have I could have had her fight me on an empty stomach. But you've slowly been changing and you're not so much of a jerk anymore. I drag her into my own pace, and before she could regain her rhythm, I take the first match in a heartbeat. But victory isn't the only thing I want from Nisan. It's not about the results, it's about the journey. That's why I want Nisan to be in tip top shape. I don't mind having to wait another 15 minutes. Alright. So, they're in back again. <laughs> After we finished our bread, we played for an for about an hour. It had already gotten dark outside. The logo on his on the back of Kaito's phone droid. What is that? Is is that that um that you know s skull uh brand logo again, or or is that the Kill Ballad logo. Oh, actually, I think it is the Kill Ballad logo. That would make a lot of sense, actually. <laughs> but neither of us cared. We just kept staring down at our phone droids as we played Kill Ballad. I'm sure from an outsider's perspective, we might look weird. No, it, it just looks like they're kind of on a date, playing video games. <laughs> but the two of us are dead serious. Well, Kaito's dead serious, for sure, and uh, Naya's just like, a a happily playing. <laughs> I can feel my heartbeat speeding up during our matches. And from adrenaline. It's almost painful. Uh, I hope he doesn't go in, into his slow-mo attack. If I lose concentration for even a split second, I'll lose. I've been sitting on the edge of my seat this whole time. And I'm not just sweating because of the heat. I feel alive. Nice hug. Pardon me. Nison's skills are the real deal. Plus, she's getting used to the game's mechanics at, a, at an alarming rate. Which means that the more we play, the more likely it is for me to lose. Right, I remember Kaito saying that after a certain amount of matches that he eventually loses focus. I remember him br bringing that up uh, after uh, Subaru had uh, faced him in Kill Ballad. And that's how Subaru won against him. It sucks when I take the L. <laughs> like a big old L on the forehead. <laughs> if I don't take a if I don't play another match after losing, I feel at a loss. And so, Nisan and I just keep playing, on and on. It's also been a while since I played an opponent who was sitting right next to me. When I used to play Misane, phone droids weren't widespread yet, so we were always playing, uh, played sitting next to each other. She really whooped my ass back then. <laughs> Misune was a high schooler, and I was an elementary schooler. And now that he's older, he's gotten a lot better. But she didn't take 
any sort of mercy on me. It sounds very familiar, doesn't it? Much how, like, Kaito does the same thing now, <laughs> himself. As a kid who only knew how to mash buttons, I didn't stand a chance. Oh, he was a button masher when he was a kid. <laughs> What? <laughs> abandoning, abandoning his post as captain of his soul? What does she mean by that? I get goosebumps alongside a feeling of distant nostalgia. Misune was merciless back then. Just like you now. I can't help but grimace as I think back on the old days. Ah, uh, nostalgia. <laughs> I then glance at the girl sitting next to me. If I was still in the past, I'd see Misune's profile. Well, he... He did say that, uh... Nai reminds him of Misune, so... I, I guess that's only natural. But right now, it's nice on. <laughs> Since she's right next to me, her physical reactions are directly communicated to me. <laughs> it's especially obvious when she's in a disadvanta disadvantageous situation. That's a mouthful. <laughs> She doesn't react as much when she's winning because she still has her composure. When up against the wall, people start breathing harder, grinding teeth. <laughs> Some even click their tongues or swear. <laughs> I'm not gonna swear though. <laughs> it's like, I'm not really the swearing type. I mean, I, I don't... I don't like to say the F word. Um, in... Although, when I'm on the cusp of saying it, I'll say it as the way the Scottish say it. Uh, which, if you don't know, is uh, thick. Thick. Most, the most I say is shit or damn. <laughs> There are all kinds of reactions. When I'm playing, I sharpen my senses, so I naturally pick up on these signs. <laughs> Nisan doesn't overreact. She takes a few light moaning breaths. I picked this up over the last few hours. It's actually kind of sexy. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, I'm, uh, I'm surprised. Honestly, kind of surprised that Kaito finds that sexy. Well, I obviously don't say that aloud, <laughs> since she'd probably be weirded out. Either weirded out, or who knows, she may find that a little flattering. I mean, is <laughs> some sometimes Nai can be an open book. And, you know, she... I, yeah, I think that's the best way to put it, really. That she's an open book. It's like, sh she just kind of takes things as they come. <sighs> and that's that. I won. Ten to, ten to five. Well, that, that's uh, fairly even, then. I and... Nisan sits her phone droid off to the side and stretches up into the air. <sighs> I mean, when you're playing video games competitively, I'm sure... Uh players like this do get rather 
uh, exhausted afterwards. It's like, I've never played competitively, so I, I don't know how that feels. If they had played any longer, he would have lost focus, like he did with Subaru. Nisan is massaging her own shoulders while grimacing. Her focus must be sapped. If we keep going, we're gonna start lagging. Since it's already dark, I guess it's time to call it. Yeah, good game, good game. So this car? I was always a little bit of 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 I mean, Kaito was extremely focused. I mean, you can see it on his face. Yes, I won this two hour battle of ours. Isn't that also how long Kaito and Subaru played? Or was, or was it longer than that? I can't remember. Every single match was a close one. If things had settled in her favor, I wouldn't have been surprised. I noticed that the fingers on my right hand are shaking a little. I applied too much strength to them while I was inputting combos. I mean, why would you need to use so much strength in pressing a buttons on your phone? <laughs> Proof that I was in the zone. <laughs> Not the Twilight Zone. Although the way that this uh, game is going with its mystery, it's kind of turning into the Twilight Zone in a way. But if I'm this exhausted, I'm a little worried about getting an attack. It does feel kind of good though. And I'm glad he didn't get an attack. Nisan stands up and looks at the night sky. この島はどう気に入ってもらえた？はい、とってもいいところですよ。東京と比べると不便じゃない？I mean, I'm sure Nai thinks that it's a little more, you know, slower. That it's a lot slower paced, actually. Um, I mean, Tokyo is a big city. It's like Tanegashima in comparison is like much a much calmer environment. Okay. So, so just at certain times. And she likes the nature. <laughs> そう言ってもらえると地元民としても嬉しいよ。ただ今月末でまた東京に戻らなくちゃいけないんですよね。Oh really? Oh. Uh, oh, that's right. She did say that she was going to have to return to Tokyo, but I I thought that was going to be like a lot later than than that. Don't hmm. My uh, my memory's a little hazy. Huh? I doubt my own ears. Did you just say the end of the month? That's only four days from now. Yeah, it's like the it's the twenty seventh right now. So yeah, that's very very soon. I mean, she just told you, so, and I take it that she didn't tell anyone else in the robot club, so it's like, how, how would have anyone told them if they didn't know? 
キのことよろしくねおおそれでおおかい This is interesting. He, he's seeing this as a.、Uh, he's seeing this as Misane leaving and seeing that Nai reminds him of Misane. That's going to be a big blow to him, isn't it? Oh.、Uh, I kind of feel bad for him then. Because it's like for, to ha- for that to happen to him again, just with another person, an- another older girl, it's like that, that's. Yeah. Oh man, I'm sorry, Kaito? Hano to Kimi Tiny. Mata. Mata. Oh, we take no Kayo. Oh. He. He. He doesn't. See Nai as Nai, he sees her as Misane. Nai doesn't just remind Kaito of Misane. To Kaito, she is Misane. Oh. Yeah. That's definitely gonna hurt. Mmm. Oh. Kaito k u n Huh? I. Yeah. I snap back to reality. Crap. I think I just said something weird. <laughs> He. Huh. <sighs> uh. I mean, it, it, it's. <sighs> This is going into a territory that's. I feel. Very、uh, touchy for Kaito. I mean, Misane. Left him. Years ago with. Telling him to take care of Akiho. And while Nai isn't necessarily doing the same thing verbatim, it's. She, he's seeing it as a little similar to what Misane did to him so long ago. Ore, Cuny Hennacotte. Jotto be Christian Tessa. Die job with his car. He's not all right. Hecky, ya, Hecky John Icamo. Nice and to walk a sonoga sabishk Tessa. <laughs> Naisan continues to look at me with a concerned expression on her face. I mean, and Nai is not only concerned, but she's also confused. It's like, from her perspective, I'm sure she's thinking, like, what is wrong with、uh, Kaito kun? So, hmm, it, this, this is difficult, very difficult. 
I stay locked on her gaze and flash her a f and flash her a fake smile, trying to stay strong, but is having a hard time doing so. One of her own eventually takes shape. ああ、もちろん。せっかく対等に勝負できる相手を見つけられたのに、残念すぎるよ。うん、なるほど。でも、本当に帰っちゃう。こんな急に? I mean, kind of. ほら、2号機の予算の件で本社と交渉しなくちゃいけなくなりまして。Okay, and you have to do that in Tokyo? それで一度戻ることにしたんです。Okay. And pro and probably uh spend a little time with her father too. <laughs> また10月くらいになったらこっちに来る予定ですけどね。Be back in October. Okay. So, we got a whole month. In a month, yes. It still sucks that after finally finding someone I can play in person, she's not going to be accessible for a bit. Well... They may not be able to play in person, but they could play each other uh, long distance. So I, uh, I'm not sure I really see the issue, the issue here because you know, it's like Kill Ballads online. Everyone's online. So you can easily play the game long distance. They would just have to schedule a time to actually play. I'm more disappointed than I expected. <laughs> I've never lived on the beach, so I don't really know. Umi?まあ、10月じゃ無理だと思うよ。風邪ひいてもいいならとめないけど。もしかして、海に行きたかったとか? I'm surprised that she didn't during her time here already. え、せっかく南国の島に来たわけですから、海とっても綺麗ですし、全然人もいないでしょ。海水浴をするには最高の環境じゃないですか。うん、でも次にこっちに来るのが10月だと、もう種子島の海には入れないかなと。来年の夏まで行くかもわからないですし。うん。こっちに来ることが決まってから、真っ先に海水浴に行こうと思ってたんですけどね。Beaching it up. That's an interesting phrase. <laughs> I've never heard that before. そのために気合い入れて三鷹で水着も買ってきたんですから。なのに、ずっとバタバタしてて、機械を逃しちゃいました。Well, darn. Busy, huh? I mean, I'm sure her job is a very busy, a hard work. That sucks since JAXA was on break all through Obon. Obon. I, th I believe you say it a bone. And wait, if she didn't go home for a bone, 
Doesn't that mean she was here the whole time? Well, whatever. I won't sweat the deets. <laughs> I surprise even myself. I mean, it sounds a little like uh, Kaito is asking Nai on a date, doesn't it? <laughs> I'm not the sort of guy who would voluntarily ask a girl out. But yet, here you are, Kaito, asking Nai out on what sounds like a date. Maybe I'm more into Nisan than I thought? I mean... <laughs> is there anything wrong with that? Kaito-kun, tomorrow is a Let's see, uh... Okay, today's the... A Tuesday. So, and she leaves at the end of the month. So, if I go to the... I believe it's... My daily records. Yeah. So... She goes home at the end of the month. So on the 31st. When was she planning on actually leaving on the 21st, on the 31st? Because, you know, they could do some swimming before she leaves on the 31st. So, that's an idea. Yeah, why not? <laughs> I mean... He's only asked... He's only asking this to you, Nai. What do you think about going out with a younger guy? <laughs> <laughs> I had a feeling that she was gonna ask him that. <laughs> Very smooth. Wow. <laughs> I, I mean, I can't say that all of them are bold, uh, given that we don't really see much of any other high schoolers than, you know, just, you know, the robot club members, so <laughs> that's hard to say. <laughs> I've never asked a girl out on a date before. Well, you just did. But... I want to spend as much time as I can with Nisan. Try and hold on... as much as he can. Spend as much time with her as possible. I want to get to know her better. God, I sound so cheesy right now. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that, Kaito. Absolutely nothing wrong with it. I mean... It, it sure sounds like that Kaito is falling for Mai, doesn't it? I mean, he... Just his inner monologue right now, just it, it feels that way. Okay, so we're off to the beach. <laughs> I call out to mom and leave from the front door. 
Even though it isn't noon yet, a powerful beam of sunlight rains down on my face from above. I'm glad it's nice today. I'm supposed to meet Nison at 10 a.m. I'm going to pick her up at the JAXA employee dormitory. Wait, what? JAXA has an employee dormitory? The, huh. I mean, for a small island like Tanegashima, that I was not expecting. I mean, <laughs> huh. I'm kind of flabbergasted by that. It's like, I've never heard of a workplace having a dormitory for their employees. Since Uchigaoka Park is on the way, I plan to take care of business beforehand. I throw my stuff into the front basket of my scooter, and just as I try to put my helmet on, I notice something. Yeah? In the corner of the narrow garden. A flower? There are some red flowers blooming. I mean, what kind of flower is this? I only now realize that we have hibiscus flowers blooming in our yard. Hibiscus flowers. We need that. Maybe I noticed it because Nisan was talking about them the other day. Otherwise, I'd never take an interest in the flowers in our garden. What did she say about them again? Yeah, that's right. Her explanation left an impression on me. Well, then Kaito should pick the flower for her and give it to her. I mean, that, <laughs> that would feel even more like a date. Hi. Hi, Akiho. Fancy meeting you here. Um, <laughs> what's Kaito going to tell her? Oh, it's hockey home. <laughs> it's like, just like it's any other day, right? Oh, it's a hockey home. Hi. <laughs> I guess she swung by while going for a walk. Ohio. And actually, yes. Ohio. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm skipping club today because I'm going to go to the beach and swim with Nisan. <laughs> He's not going to say that, though. Hmm. <laughs> Covered. Oh, recovered from the news of the final episode of Gundaral. Right. Ah, Yeah. The day of the leak, Akio was so stunned that she couldn't eat. More disappointed. Okay. <laughs> Facing adversity? 
Is it Akiho? So they demo gambarilla, which no skin a gambarilla de Nanimo Kawara nice, eh? And that's all that matters to her. That Gunvarel is still Gunvarel. I'm glad she's recovered so quickly. Same. Dekai, go on as a hoyo kara, do go kun. And this is where he should just like turn around and wave. Nae san to date. Oh! Color be surprised, he's actually telling her! <laughs> I. She, she didn't say anything, she just made a noise, and that translated to a. 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 Her nice request. <laughs> Not really. Kai, Tenoji Santo, it's no money son and Nakayokunatano. Last night, so it's like in the Masaka Kokuhakista Toka. Just last night. Here. <laughs> Akio's <laughs> not gonna take this the in the same way that uh, Kaito is. <laughs> Yeah, strong. Yeah, strong. <laughs> Wait, what? It's strong? <laughs> there we go. It's like, thank you for clarifying it for her, Kaito. Kirubara. Ah, so. Kirubara. なんでも中学生の頃から東京の<笑> Well, yeah. <laughs> huh? What is she, why does she seem disappointed in me? She doesn't seem particularly disappointed. Akio lowers her shoulders as she walks back the way she came. Does she feel a little dejected? Oh, Akio. I mean, the, the, I feel like this moment here is actually solidifying my theory of that there's more than something there than just being childhood friends between the between the two of them. But Kaito doesn't know it. <laughs> well, whatever. I mean, she more than likely came over to spend time with Kaito, but he just told her that she's that he's going on a date with Nai. I mean, what is she supposed to think now that? She doesn't have a chance with Kaito. That they're too that that they're too close as friends to be anything more than just friends. I'm gonna be late if I don't get moving. 
Let's do this. Oh, switching to Akio's perspective. Hmm. Uh, I bet a lot of, a lot, a lot, a lot of things are going through her mind right now. <laughs> Especially what she just learned from Kaito. <laughs> uh, but, uh, I think, <laughs> I think we'll have to save what is going through her mind for next time. And I, I actually hate to uh, stop it here right now, but... You know, uh, I want to try and be consistent with my length of my videos, so I hope you all understand, and as per usual, I hope you all enjoyed watching, and thank you all for watching as well. And if you enjoyed the video and want to see more, like, favorite, and claw that subscribe button to become part of the pack. And as always, everyone, I hope you all have a wonderful day or night, wherever you may be.